guys and welcome back to my channel and I hope you guys are ready because this is my very first makeup tutorial and I did it earlier today because I went out and I not too long got back in with the little mess so I hope you guys enjoy it and stay tuned and also if you like my earrings there's a tutorial coming up on that very shortly I turned my favorite vintage buttons into earrings and I'll show you guys how to do that so stay tuned for that tutorial but anyhow let's go on to makeup and I hope you guys enjoy bye makeup so I hope my makeup tutorial is good I'm not as good anymore like all of the other girls queen of blending and um Beat Face Honey, Petrulou, I'm not that good, but I'm getting there. So, a treat for myself, I bought Eyes, Lips, Face, 144 palette for $15, it's by e.l.f., and I got it at Target. I have bought a set of Victoria Jackson baby doll color kit and I have some other and I have their the lip gloss and this is called the baby doll color kit color kit as I said again and this is my staple I lo absolutely love it you see I've been killing my the lip gloss area um I use Sephora on my face I love Sephora my color is D55 if you can see it D55 um, I love to use hard candy eyeshadow primer and I have two of these <laughs> I also have this is my favorite eyeshadow I have one two three four five I have five of these one in navy blue one in brown two green and and one black I think yeah one black and this is my favorite from hard candy and this is the color is called black out the color is called black out and I also love using their plexi gloss from hard candy and I bought a 24 makeup brush professional kit from shiny cosmetics and this is my favorite I and it came with a free case so yeah so let's get into the makeup tutorial now what I do I pr this is my lip balm lip medics from Blistex this is my favorite I use this so much throughout winter um my family my whole entire household even the baby I put it on his lips and my husband steals it every time so what I'm doing I'm priming my lips with this so that I don't get any shopping or shifting when I go outside. Is the weather is beautiful outside? As you can see, my house is well lighted from the light outside, and then I just don't want to waste it. So I decided to take the baby out. If you like my earrings, there's a tutorial coming up on these just now. Um, these are actual old vintage buttons that I bought. And I turned them into earrings. So there's a tutorial coming up on that also. Okay? And the reason I have a socket cap on my head, just getting it all out the way, is that I wear a wig. So let's shut up, Maria, and do the tutorial. So what I'm going to do first, I'm going to prime my eyes with eyeshadow. With, um, with my eyeshadow primer. And I'm gonna dab it on like that. I'm using my webcam because set up my camera and the tripod and everything. It's gonna drive me nuts. So this is what I do. I prime my eyeshadow, my eyelid with the primer. And today I'm just doing eyeshadow and um my eyes and lips because I don't want to wear press powder today now I'm gonna use 
my shadow brush. This is not from the same people, but this is the brush I have. And today, I'm wearing coral pink. My scarf is coral pink. So I'm going to go with a nice, fun color today. So I think I'll be going with this color down here. This is the color I'm going with today. And I'm also going to be going with a brown. My natural color brown. So you get the powder on the brush. I need to get my mirror out. Sorry guys. And you're going to apply it into the inner corner and to the center of your eyelid. And you just dab it on like that. If you're like me, I like to go subtle sometimes. Sometimes I like to go out there but today is just an uh, in between not too subtle not too out there for me today I'm gonna do the other side I absolutely love this color it's the first time I'm using this color It's darker than the other. And what you try to do is to make both eyes evenly colored. Because one of my eyes was darker than the other. So then I'm going into my brown. And I'm going to start from the center to the and the rest of the outer of my eye. And then we're going to take a blending brush and we're going to blend the center. And this is just after you're going outside. Nothing special. If I wanted to vamp this up all the way, take your blending brush and blend the center. Take the red and blend it over the brown. Till it's even. Don't blend it all out. You also like to do light strokes. Like a dusting. See? Well blended. Now, to clean this up, I am going to use my brown in the baby doll kit. I'm going to apply it into the crease and to the top part right here. Then I'm going to take the gold and highlight underneath my eyebrow. So. Here we go. And I'm using my blending brush. Because the little color from the blending brush with the brown is going to do a perfect mixture to me. It is a perfect mixture to blend up and it settles down everything else. It gives a natural color like, like a fade to me. 
As I tell you guys, I am not a professional makeup artist. I'm a beginner. But this is how I do my makeup. And then I'm going into the gold. The clear one here. I'm going to highlight under my eyebrow. I'm going to just blend that all in. Okay. And that's it for my eyes. Now, what's I'm going to do? Mascara. I love, love, love this mascara. So bad. This is super dark. And it is. It lasts long, though. I'm going to tell you on honest truth. It lasts long. How I apply it, I put it to the base and I go sideways like that. It gives your lashes extension. And then too, the reason I do sideways in the roots and then come up straight is that I don't like clumping of my eyeshad of my eyelashes actually. So that's why I do that. So I don't get clumping. Sorry. I am so not doing an intense look today. I really don't want an intense look today. And I'm gonna outline my lips with my red hot. And so I say I'm going to be using this color here and this color right here for my lips. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add the darker. I always use my fingers. Your fingers is the, one of the best makeup tools there is. And this is a nude. A new pink. Oh, my back hurts. Get a finger and apply the pink. Add color. And 
and there you have it that's my makeup and that's it I hope you guys enjoy it super short I know I'm trying to use up my natural sunlight so I don't have to sit with a camera in the light and um, yeah so this is my look for when I'm just going outside and I don't feel like doing my face completely up when I'm not going to event so this is it I hope you guys like it and tell me you give me your guys your comments and your tips that will be greatly 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 appreciated Bring the oh, oh my gosh I'm so, like, so nervous to upload this video now <laughs> totally um okay so that's it bye Hot.